ES58 solenoid valve. It's a three-way normally open valve, suitable for applications where you want to be able to pass a signal through when there's no power on it. It's a normally open function. When it's energised, it cuts that signal off and exhausts the downstream air or fluid. doesn't make any difference. It's a 304 stainless steel body with a Viton seat. has a connector here. It's a LED connector plug, IP65 encapsulated coil. Uh, available in a variety of voltages. I'll just take it apart and show you how this operates. I've loosened this off previously. Coil slides off like that, so it can be serviced in, in situ. This is a three-way normally open valve, so when the supply is connected on the top here, it's going feeding through and out through port A. We've got a legend on the side here, P's in, A is out, and R is exhaust. So no power on the unit, we're getting a signal out, so it's normally open. Put the power on the unit, electrify it through the coil, and that signal is then cut off, and the downstream is exhausted. So it's a normally open function. Put, we take the power off, and we get the product or media being passed through the valve. So down through here, out this port here, port A, turn the power off and the armature comes up and blocks off P and we get A and R connected to exhaust. I'll just take this apart. Inside here we have the seat. So normally this armature is seated down on there and the air or media will go down through the stem and out through this hole on the side and that will give the normally open function so the liquid is going through and out. When the armature is energised it lifts off and blocks it goes right up into that top stem here, blocks the signal off, and we get the supply coming back out through this hole, down through the little jet, and out. It's a 1.5 millimeter jet in this particular case. Uh, it comes in a 16 bar pressure range. So it's a very efficient bit of equipment. Um, Energise the coil armature is pulled up, de-energised, it goes down and it's blocking off the exhaust port.